Hello, good morning everyone. Make love shout out to all the subscribers and to the new followers of this channel. This is Marie Piet on the show. And we are going to today we're going to talk about the different types of mangoes and its characteristics. Please hang on. What is a mango? Mangifera indica, commonly known as mango, is a species of flowering plant in the family of Anacardicae. It is a large fruit tree capable of growing to a height of 30 meters or 100 feet. There are two distinct genetic populations in modern mangoes, the Indian type and the South Asian type. It is a large green tree, valued mainly for its fruits, both green and ripe. Approximately 500 varieties have been reported in India. It can grow up to 15 to 30 meters or about 50 to 100 feet tall with a similar crown with a trunk circumference of more than 3.7 meters or 12 feet. The leaves are simple, shiny, and dark green. Red yellow flowers ap appear at the end of the winter and at the beginning of spring. Both male and female flowers are born on the same tree. Climatic conditions have a significant influence in the time of flowering. In South Asia, flowering starts in December in the South, in January in Bingo, February in Eastern Utah of Pradesh and Bihar, and in February to March in Northern India. The duration of flowering is 20 to 25 days for the Hishiri, Hishiri variety, while pinnacle emergence occurs in early December and flower opening is completed by February. The Nilam variety produces two crops a year in Kankayumi, Tamil Nadu, but it flowers only once in North Indian conditions. The mango is an irregular egg-shaped fruit which is fleshy and drooped. Mangoes are typically 8 to 12 centimeters or 3 to 5 five inches long and greenish yellow in color. The fruit can be round, oval, heart or kidney shape. Mango fruits are green when they are unripe. The interior flesh is bright orange and soft with the large flat pit in the middle. Mangoes are mature or mature in April and May. Raw mangoes can be used in the making of pickles and Ripe mangoes are a popular fruit throughout the world. The skin and pulp count for 85% of the mango's weight, and the remaining 15% comes from the stone or the seed. Chemistry of a mango Mang Mangiferin, or a pharmacologically active hydroxylated santone or C glycoside is extracted from mango at high concentrations from the young leaves. It's about 175 grams per kilogram. Bark is 107 gram per kilogram. And from old leaves it's 94 grams per kilogram. Allergenic urocells are present in the fruit peel. Toxicity. Urocells in a fruit peel can trigger contact dermatitis in sensitized individuals. This reaction is more likely to occur in people who have been exposed to other plants from the family Anacardiaceae, kids such as poison oak and, I and poison ivy, which are widespread in the United States. The wood is known to produce a phenolic substances that can cause contact dermatitis. Uses Wow! A tree is more known for its fruit 
rather than for it to convert. However, mango trees can be converted to lumber once their fruit-bearing lifespan has finished. The wood is susceptible to damage from fungi and insects. The wood is used for mi musical instruments such as ukuleles, plywood, and low-cost furniture. The bark is used to produce a yellow dye. Culture The mango is a national fruit of India, Pakistan, and the Philippines, and is a national tree of Bangladesh. We have the different varieties of mangoes in the Philippines. There are three varieties of mango or Filipino mangoes in the Philippines. We have Carabao mango, the Atahong Olpo, and the Chico. The Carabao mangoes is the most common type in the Philippines. It is green skin and sweet choice of flesh. The Atahong Olpo mango is also known as honey mango. It has yellow skin and sweet fragrant flesh. A chico mango is the smallest type of mango found in the Philippines and it has red skin and part sour flesh. <laughs>